So I guess it's still people out here trying to tell people that spirituality is evil and demonic. I'm finna put an end to this shit. Guys, people out here saying that Egyptians were evil and satanic. Saying that we got our tree of life from Satan. But since y'all don't know, they took everything from us. I want y'all to pause it and read it. So y'all be seeing shit like that because y'all don't know y'all history. Y'all be ignorant speaking of stuff y'all don't know about. I want y'all to take a look at the flower of life. This is the origin of all creation. Now I want to just show y'all how they just take everything from us. This is how we got the tree of life. Just a stem from the flower of life. And they over here trying to make it evil. The Egyptians were here before the Bible, before Satan was even introduced. So all that stuff was made way before anything satanic. So I just want to go off the satanic versions and act like that was first. I want y'all to look at this six point star right here. You see how they reversed it and made it the six point star of David? The flower of life makes up 33 circles. 33 circles birthed all creation. That's why we had 33 vertebrae in our spawn. That's why Jesus died at 33. And that's why the top degree in Freemasonry is 33. So you see, they took all this shit from us. The Egyptians actually understood the flower of life. Like I said, we have all the knowledge within us. We have just been cut off from our knowledge. The Egyptians were in tune naturally. They were connected to the source. Their pineal glands were open. I'll be so quick to say the third eye is evil because the Illuminati uses the eye. Not even knowing they got that from us too. That's the thing. Y'all don't know y'all history. Y'all are ignorant. That's why y'all be saying shit like that. Look at the pineal gland and look at the design around it. They took this from us. And now we have this. Now they taking y'all stuff and scaring y'all away from it. Saying it's evil. The reason why this is disconnected from the bottom of the pyramid. Because they're putting in your face every day that they took your knowledge away and you don't know your history. I'm telling you, you are disconnected from your third eye. You are disconnected from your higher self. They put it on a dollar bill so you have to see that shit every day. Now they be trying to say that the Kundalini energy is evil and demonic because of the Adam and Eve story. The Kundalini energy is just symbolic to your cerebrospinal fluid. I'll call everything evil and demonic. You lack knowledge on something, so now you make a video to spread false information to other people because you don't fully have an understanding of something. Not only that, y'all be taking people away from happiness and their true divinity because they don't believe in what y'all believe in. I have no idea how y'all look helping these elites keeping us programmed, keeping us asleep. The reason why we use the snake for our kundalini energy is because once your cerebrospinal fluid rises up your spine and hits your pineal gland, it now swells up and opens up like a cobra. So that's why the pharaohs put snakes on their head to symbolize that they had their pineal gland open. Everything was science behind what our ancestors did. It was nothing evil or satanic at all. All the ones that be disrespecting them and labeling them as evil and demonic. Meanwhile, these are your fucking ancestors. You have no idea how you look helping these elites. Keeping people away from meditation and eating healthy. There's not one problem with spirituality, so why is y'all trying to keep people away from it? All it takes is a little research. A little, y'all.